Hello guys, welcome back to a brand new video today. Um, yet again, as you can tell by the title, um, is my match preview for the Columbia game which England has got played in the last 16. We've had our first bit of big news in this World Cup and that is that Germany are out of the World Cup. Um, very much unexpected. Um, obviously it's blown the World Cup wide open now. Anyone can take it. Um, so guys without any further ado, subscribe for more, thanks for watching and let's get into it. Right, so, um, my starting 11 for the Columbia game, it is back to full strength. It weren't as weak as the one I put out against the warm up uh, second game uh, against Belgium. Um, obviously, their second team first our second team. That's the whole idea behind that. Why well, I put Butlin in goal, but that's not happening. This is a full strength team. Which I would personally go with. I've got a funny feeling Southgate might go with. Um, just one little thing before I start telling you this 11. John Stones had a strap on his leg last night. Um, and in the Belgium game while he was on the bench. But if that don't, if that's not a major injury, this I think will be, will be the starting lineup. So I went back in goal. I have put Jordan Pitford. Um, he ain't done much wrong. Uh has done a good goal last night, but obviously Pitford is our number one. We all know that now. So I'll go back with Pitford in goal. In right back, in right wing back I should say, I've gone with Kyle Walker. Um now Kyle Walker hasn't done much wrong. I would put him back in there and give Trippier a break. Um, I think Carl Walker needs the game time uh, as well because don't don't forget none of you know uh, after the World Cup the players that are involved in the World Cup will go have a couple of weeks break and then come back into club training and um, obviously I'm hoping most of you know that both not you do now. So I'll definitely give Carl Walker a game for this one. In centre, in the right centre back, I've gone with uh, Harry Maguire. Um, he wasn't a personal favourite of mine when the World Cup started, but I've started to grow to like him a little bit. Um, obviously a Premier League player. Uh, I saw him play down here. Um, so you know, it's going to be quite interesting. As I said, I've grown to like uh, the Harry Maguire and I keep it going. Um, so that's my left wing back position, left centre, left centre back I should say. In dead centre back and this could change obviously as I've said to his injury that he could possibly have is John Stones. Uh, he ain't had a bad competition, I don't think. Put your comments below. Put in the comments below who's um, who do you think's had the best competition? Um, how f now? Literally, how far do you think we can get as well? It'd be quite interesting. Obviously, we know we're running now. If we beat Colombia, we got either Sweden or Switzerland, but. In centre back, I have gone with John Stones. In right centre back, I have gone with Cahill. Now, yet yeah, again, they could switch them two round. I put Cahill in centre back and John Stones on the right side. Um, but I put Cahill on the right side purely because I think it might help the team a bit better as well. Um, in right. Wing back, I have gone with Ashley Young. Um, now he missed out uh, in left, yeah. Uh, in left wing back, I have gone with Ashley Young. Um, 
obviously doing play against Belgium. I could see him come back into the squad as well. So that's why I put him in there. As I said, it's a full strength team. So in uh, on the left side of the mid, I have gone with Eric Dyer. Uh, there's been a lot of talk about maybe uh, pairing Henderson and Dyer together. So I could possibly see that. Uh, in centre, I've just given it away, is Jordan Henderson. Um, and then on the right side, I've gone with Jesse Lingard. Um, obviously, I think, I think yeah, again, he's had a good competition. I think a lot of England players have had a good competition. Um, but obviously, the real test starts now. Um, in... On the strikes, I have gone with Harry Kane. Um, still the top goal scorer, as far as I know. Didn't play against Belgium. Obviously, saved him for the uh, Colombia game. Um, obviously, there's no second chances now. If we lose, we're out. Um, now, before I see my last player, oh, I, when I used to play football, um, you. The expression used to be, you're only as good as your last competition. Well, our last competition, we got knocked out against Iceland, so that's why I'm not cut, that's why I'm not cut Columbia off completely. Because Iceland took us out the, took us out the book and swooped us aside. I can see Columbia doing the same. So, I'm not, I'm not cutting any team short in this competition. Uh, obviously it's in Germany being knocked out, so that's a bit of a point as well. Uh, and then my other striker side, I've gone with Marcus Rashford. Um, so, as I said, back to full strength. Um, guys, you know what to do, subscribe for more, thanks for watching. Cheer for now and come on England.